<laughs> well, hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Ranger Shadows of Almia. Last time we caught. <laughs> There's a Blossom. Uh, bye. We caught Magnezone as well as Cresselia. Oh man. The Magnezone wasn't that bad, though, honestly. So, for today's episode, we're gonna head back to the Ranger Union because we're done. Now, if I could only find a Straptor. Oh man, there isn't. A two. What? Oh man, I wonder how that will it'll ever be explained. Okay, so let's go catch a Straptor. It's up here, by the way. And um, there you are. Hi. Okay. Phew. Oh man, you guys, you wouldn't believe what we have in store for next. Uh. But don't worry. It's kind of the whole reason, well, actually it's for not a while, but it's the whole reason why I wanted to make this as a let's play. Let's go. Um, there we are. Okay. Back to the Ranger Union. Yes. <laughs> Carry T-Tar with us. Oh, cool. Okay. Dun -dun -dun. Subdudes. Well, I see. Understood. The yellow gem has fallen into the hands of Team Dimza. Oh, that happened last episode too, by the way. Mr. Keith had to be saved, so... We had a trade. Fine, so it goes. We'll devise a new plan accordingly. There is no time to be feeling sorry for ourselves. Yeah, no, I just feel bad for Keith. He must feel terrible. Yeah, it's a good thing he's safe. Yeah, that, that's, that's the main thing. Yeah, but, yeah, it could wait overnight. Uh huh. I already healed after that mag zone battle. Just saying. Oh, the next day. Oh man. Okay. Uh, that's probably gonna be a lot of talking. Spoilers. Oh hey, I was sleeping. What were you guys doing? Jeez, did you sleep last night? No, I just sat here for like two minutes. I couldn't sleep. I'm so choked up over this. Oh, Keith! Professor Hastings, have you learned anything from the incredible mobile machines? <coughs> Prince. Nothing yet, I'm afraid. The data disk is password protected. I have defined our efforts to crack it. I questioned Isaac about it, but he's become <coughs> withdrawn. I do have some good news, though. Significant advances have been made in deciphering the <coughs> diary. There is an entry some three years before the Shadow Crystal <coughs> discovery. <coughs> I spent another day pouring through old documents, <coughs> writing. <laughs> it sounds like he's dying. I learned of the red gem, the blue gem, and the yellow gem. I learned how the Shadow Crystals fears and loathes the harmony of the gems, and how it also strangely seeks their harmony. I now understand what I must do while I still live in harmony. It is to live in harmony. Oh, uh, that's as far as I <coughs> got before I had to cough. Still, it gives us hope. Our hypothesis was correct. The three colored gems have an effect on a shadow <coughs> crystal. It's clear Brighton Hall came to that same realization. Oh, Brighton. That's a city, by the way. Excuse me, it's Isaac. I thought things through last night. What? what? Isaac? <gasps> it's Isaac. Well, better make room. I'm ashamed to realize this now. I saw, but I didn't understand anything. All I've seen of the world was through a microscope or a PC monitor. Oh, PC gamers. But all that changed yesterday. Whoa. Even though I'm supposed to be an enemy, Tzvidden treated me like a brother. Wow. Professor Hastings shouted at me three times, asking for the password. But he left me alone after that. I was given a comfortable bed and a warm breakfast. Oh, like warm cereals, like that. And everyone was smiling, and, 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 and I. It took so long, but I finally realized that I was being used. I didn't want to believe it. I couldn't admit it yesterday. I was too scared to. I'm scared. The password is Melody! It's my little sister's name. Oh, who does that? 
Melody's in Paul Town. I wonder how she is. Okay. That's totally not some kind of insight in what will happen. Wink, wink. Oh, man, spoilers. Eliza, well, thank you. That's a courage. This could say <coughs> all of you. <laughs> tell the researchers the password is Melody. Yeah, tell everyone your password's Melody. Everyone's going to hack into your email, into your YouTube account, in fact, dude. What have you done? Hey, who are you? Nage, yeah, I remember that guy. We're ready. That, that's great. Very well. I'll bring up the data on the underfoot monitor, if you will. Oh man, they got bazillions of dollars, so they're just gonna step on their monitors here. Whoa, this was totally worth it. Hey, Irma, get out of the way. You, Gage. No, Nage. Nage. No, it's not Gabe. Uh, oh, the shape. I've seen this shape somewhere, and it's only Keith has the weirdest voice. This can't be. Yeah, what is this? I'd say it might be. This is Ultra Tower! <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, Ultra Tower. It's the Incredible Machine, so... If you're paying attention, Ultra Tower is the Incredible Machine in which controls every single Pokemon nationwide. Worldwide, probably. Oh, man. Take a close look over at the blueprint. See, at the top of the tower, overlooking all of all the other objects on the top, it's probably the Giant Shadow Crystal! Yeah, it's kind of crystal-y. So this is what it's all about. <coughs> Ow. Give me a second to get breaths of fresh air. Okay, hey Irma. When the professor gets into the state, he won't emerge for a while. He calls it his solitary strategy session. So... What can you do in the meantime? Why? Patrol, of course! Oh, uh, patrols! <laughs> Patrol, also. It'd be a wise precaution to capture strong Pokemon. Whoa! But I have a couple strong dudes with me. I mean, Irma. Look at that, like, Blossom. Oh man, watch out, dudes. I guess we're done with one today. Uh, oh, hello, Murph. Hey, listen, Kate. Tomorrow's Ultra Inc.'s birthday bash. Hey, look at this. Whoa! Flashback. Only a time volume 12. A clean new energy to be announced at the tower. Gee. And the Gorak Quads. Who cares about the Gorak Quads? The Gorak Quads live and in person. On stage, plugged in. Rocked out. I'm looking forward to it. But isn't that sort of wrong in these desperate times? Whoops. We're in operation. Now back to work. Operation. Okay, uh... Well, I think I need to talk to Irma. I'm not exactly sure. Irma, there you are. Yes, I'm ready, I'm ready. Like, you have to ask that I'm ready, I'm ready. And several hours later, I took a nap, I talked to people, and then several hours later, dude, the lady, life does not go like this. I mean, honestly. Ugh. Oh, yay, more talking. Professor, are you saying that you want please? <laughs> Before I outline our operation, you need to know about more about Alger Tower and more about it. Please, please. Yes, sir. Oh, boy. The tower is 334 meters tall. It's just shy of 1,100 feet. It's very interesting, you know. But, yeah, it's a tourist spot. It's all of all me, uh, the shadow crystal from the Chroma ruins is set at the top of the tower. Okay, we need to know that. And it unleashes power. It's like power. And a 500 mile radius of power. Incredible machine's power is equal to roughly 8 million Girimo units. Halfway up the tower is a centralized control room. Okay, so we gotta go up there. It allows control of individual Pokemon with unique signals for each one. Yeah, so they could control any Pokemon from up there. That's pretty OP, bro. These facts emerge from Isaac sharing information with us. Combined with our own data, we have a clearer picture of what we're, we're facing. Kincaid has misled Isaac all the time with false promises about the tower. A peaceful project for fostering new means of communication between Pokemon and people, he was told. So, we come to the question. What is our objective? The answer is... We found written in Brighton Hall's diary. Oh, man. Okay. My son, Blake Hall, <gasps> having just turned 16, drove me out of the company. His departing words crushed me. I will eliminate anyone who stands in the way of my world domination, even my father. 
My son has become the main character in this nightmare. The nightmare woven by the shadow crystal. That is as far as I've been able to decipher. Okay. Yeah, so Blake Hall, he's actually trying to take over the world, not Omia. Spoilers. That's pretty terrifying. Whoa! What? Is there going to be some action? Are we not going to talk all episode? No way. Uh, the test was a failure. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. That's because I was supposed to do that. Oh, however, even if they find adjustments aren't made, the tower will still operate. Wow, operation. Cool. Hmm. Even at half power, it can rock havoc far <coughs> wide. Alright, everyone, looks our, let me announce our plan. Uh, okay, so we go through the tower. And it's pretty tall, so um, Kate's gonna have to do everything. Spoilers. Oh man, what can we do? What can we do? Operation. You call. Do you recall the three pendants shown on the rooftop? Up on the rooftop, and boom, boom, down comes Blake called Shadow Crystal and all. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, I don't know what to do. Star Raptor, who would have known? Yeah, the Flying Ranger, yeah. Ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. Red and blue crystal. I need the yellow one because Keith is. Not Heath. Down came the chimney with old Saint. Play call. Oh. Okay, <laughs> you're paying attention. Now we're talking, yes. You got on me, Flight, what I'm especially good at. Okay, so we're gonna, like, go around the tower for some reason. That's lovely. Okay. Does it? Yes, it definitely displeases me. We are arranging. We'll concentrate on addressing the concerns of citizens. Indeed. That's what I hope to hear. But <laughs> you're entrusted with that task. Okay. Finally, we need a name of operation. Yeah. Okay. What is it? Operation Brighton. Oh man. Oh. Well, pff, way to be OC here, man. Bye, Barlow. Uh. Okay. Thank you. That's getting annoying. Okay. Cool. Oh, music. I have faith that you will be safe. We'll mind the union while we're gone. Well, the reporting regularly. Okay. Can I go now? Yes! Passing time. 13 minutes? Jeez! Okay. Uh, we should end. Please. Nothing happened down here. Please. Oh man, something's gonna happen. No! Something did happen! Great. Oh. Oh boy, now something happens. Hey, Murph. What do you do? B -b -b big trouble! The ground floor doors were blown apart by a wicked explosion, dude! Some big sinister guy came in and he's like, I'm gonna tell the others! No, Kate, save! Oh man. Okay, uh, what do you want? Who, who are you? You have an appointment? <laughs> oh, okay, that was the funniest thing so far. Yes. Uh, no use real, I have none. Okay, I just heard what he's saying. Look we have here, is that not Kate? You are remembering me? Yes you are. We uh, was meeting only one day ago. It is me, Heath. Send you fake voice, voice mail. That yellow gem you give me nicely as big present, we is hiding it away very, very carefully, like where it can be in Tower somewhere. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go on YouTube. Yeah. Uh, okay, just decide to crash in here. Just summon his little Evire with the expert belt, because that's like the only way to go, dude. And Evire. Okay, so there is a boss battle. Great. I was hoping we could do this next episode, but okay. We have a typically extremely long episode. You know, no, no, that's fine. I love rendering videos that are like almost 20 minutes long. Okay. Let's make this quick, dude. Ooh. Ooh, you have all the generic stuff that all elect. Wow! All electric guys have had so far. Man, I can't believe I crashed. Like, really? Okay. I don't even know what he's gonna do. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. Go, go, go. Wow. He didn't even hit me there. Oh, uh, cool. Ah, I could have kept going. 
What is that? Okay. Sailway. Okay. Pfft. I'm just as disappointed as you are. Trust me. Uh, get closer. Okay. I can get it. I can get it. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Don't grow a level though. That'd be such a waste. It discharges electricity from its body. It protects itself with an electric barrier. Whoa. Ah, yes. Good. Hey. Uh, maybe get careless too much. Uh, we... What was that? I came from upstairs. <laughs> it is going to like we planned our plan. Fool you good I did do Harry. I was playing a decoying for you too. Upstairs going is too late. What? Whoa, we got a mission. Cool, okay. Oh. Uh protect Ranger Union HQ Okay, yes, we can stop here. Uh can I walk outside? Man Heath! I don't care what you have to say. Okay, whatever. Dudes, next time. We're gonna go upstairs and have a party, okay? See you guys later.